Let us continue praying for our government. The president has put proper plans in place. By next year, we will have an improvement in terms of economy going around the country. We want to wish that the reforms that are continuing as farmers, we want to thank the president because now we have subsidized fertilizer. We have so many things to be grateful to the government. Even the tea reforms, ambaye tulifanya hapa kericho, tunataka tuarakishe, tunatupate ile guarantee minimum returns, ndiyo wakulima wa majani chai, wapate haki yao, wapate vei mzuri ya bonus, na tuende mbele, ndiyo mungu waweze kutusaidia. Na sisi tuko nyuma ya serikali, ya Rais William Ruta, tutamusaidia. Lakini wala wanazembea kazi, kazi ini wamepewa kazi na serikali na wanalala, tutawamusha pole pole tu, lakini lazima wafanyie wanaichi wa Kenya, I saw yesterday a uh, former Prime Minister's uh, interview uh, at one of the TV stations that he's saying that uh, he wants to lead uh, again Anataka Kufanya Maandamano Tena Mwaka Kesho 2024. What he's not telling Kenyans is that uh, the government has been, as the economy is steadily improving, uh, as farmers we are happy because uh, they subsidize fertilizer. Uh, to tea farmers, maize farmers, sugar cane, and all type of farmers. So at one kwa nini anasema anataka kuitisha maandamano. Lakini tunataka tumulize kama anataka kuitisha maandamano asingoje hata ifike mwaka kesho, anze kesho. Kwa sababu wanainchi wako na imani na serikali ya Dr. William Ruto. Ile mambo yote amesema jana kwa television ni kuto, kuto, kutokuwa na imani na unakutishia wa Kenya. Nafikiri wakati ya kutisha wa Kenya umepita. Hata anatakana kushukuru unaona inji zingine wana default kwa deni. Kenya haijekua default kwa deni kwa sababu we have been able to repay our public debt. Amba imesumbwe inji mingi. Hata umeona inji mingi zimeenda lea kuongezeka wale wana default the debt. And therefore tunafikiri ile mambo anasema eh, ya kusema anataka kuitisha maandamani. Nuvile sasa hameonyesha kuwa yeye anataka kuja kuaribu biashara, kuaribu maisha ya watoto wetu wanaporudi shule lakini sisi kama wale jeshi ya rais William Ruto sisi tuko tayari ku deal na yeye kwa njia yoyote kwa kupitia njia yoyote kwa sababu hatuwezi kubali wa Kenya saa hii wakati maandamano ilitishwa wakulima wengi walienda kurudi mashambani kupalilia saa hii tunapoongea tumezalisha mahindi ya kutosha Tunapoongea mafactory ya majani chai saa hii wamesema wamepata eh, tea leaves mingi sana. Tunapoongea mambo ya kahawa katika hii county ya Kericho na North Rift kwa upande yote wakulima wengi wanaendelea kulipwa bei mzuri ya mambo ya kahawa. Mambo ya, ya maziwa dairy sector inaendelea. Hata guarantee minimum returns na reforms ya mambo ya majani chai tulifanya mkutano hapa Kericho eh, tunatarajia eh, siku zijazo kupitia ofisi ya naibu wa rais na rais mwenyewe watatupea ile inaitwa guarantee minimum returns jambo la pili ni kuambia TSC washughulikie kwa bza permanent and pension about the 46000 teachers ambao wako pa, wako JSS junior secondary school na wale wako interns na contract wa kuwe confirm waingie permanent and pensionable ndio sa ile wanafunzi wetu wanaporudi shule form 1 na kuendelea na shule waweze kuwa na nafasi bora ya kuhakikisha wamerudi so that we disrupt the learning because you know teacher service commission have enough money to ensure that going into the future sana sana hapo mbele tuzi disrupt mambo ya ya masomo ya form 1 na kufungua mambo ya CBC tunashukuru kwa sababu tunaona presidential working team ime reduce the number of subjects imekuja chini na hiyo ndio kitu mzuri that's a good sign We came all the way from Eldoret. We came all the way from Eldoret. 
Principal, I take him to Jesus. Major Macho, you know, you think you need to go to Lata. Yeah, more. Gabagan, get rocks